Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have another video, thank you all the members, all the patrons, make sure to subscribe and let's get into it guys. So the question here today is, is Poland the savior of Germany? And well, what I mean about that is that, as you know, the Eurofighter was denied at the start of the year, um, that we are not even near it. And I kind of agree, that aircraft will bring another type of performance to the game, but... We're not that far off, but still, I think we are a little bit. And just like we were with the F-16AJ, for example, in Japan, we weren't that far off. Um, it was like not even a year um, from the F-16AJ being added in the F-15J, right? But Gaijin decided to add uh, the AJ as a stopgap between uh, the F-4 um, EJ Kai, that was the top tier back then, and the F-15J, which was a proper aircraft that was produced and used in Japan, right? So the German I tech tree, I think, has the same kind of problem a little bit right now. Um, because, again, the Eurofighter isn't as near as people think that it will be. It might be added, like, in the last patch of the year, but earlier than that, I kind of doubt it a little bit at least like in the we should wait like at least two patches to consider that and if that's the case when fox trees are added which are they're confirmed to come in the next patch as i already mentioned in many videos germany will need something to fire fox trees right it doesn't have any aircraft right now that can actually fire any fox trees so the stopgap would be the F4F ICE, right? But that's the problem. It is still an F4. It's a Phantom actually firing, firing AMO 20s in in a situation where any fourth generation with any semi-active missile would probably win it uh, in the BVR or any dogfight or anything like that would relate a fighting between the two aircraft, right? So it kind of creates a problem that Germany will either be suffering, <laughs> finally suffering for good for a long time until the autofighter comes, or we look into other countries to actually have um, something to stop the, that gap, right? Or to basically fill that gap. Um, one nation that can actually be added, and it's technically already in the German tech tree, is Poland, right? Poland has two options. And, of course, as I said, it is already present as the Leopard 2 PL, right? So, what could come from Poland that would basically bridge this gap between the F4F that we have right now, the MiG-29G, uh, like G, the normal G variant, uh, and the Eurofighter, uh, if the F4F IC isn't gonna cut it? Well, as I said, they have two options. Um, one of them is a like realistic one it, and it would make a lot of sense it would be kind of like the Gripen in the UK tech tree and the other one is kind of crazy and it probably never gonna be added but still I mean who knows so what is the first one an F-16 of course it's an F-16 right guys they use the F-16C block 52 right so obviously that would be the main like target for this line of thinking it would be an aircraft that is technically already in the game although we don't have that specific variant in the game we have the block 50 not the 52 uh still they are very very similar to each other right um there is a bit of a problem because the the block 52 that they have is a little bit more advanced than the, than the one that we have in the game right now if i'm not mistaken uh at least i think the radar is a little bit more modern and there are some other uh, differences in that. I think he uses the V8 version of the APG-68, uh, if I'm not mistaken, or the V9 or something like that. It is more modern than the version in the game, but it shouldn't be that different, I don't think, right? I mean, like, it is the V9, actually, which is... Isn't the V9 uh, an AESA or something? I have to check this. I don't know. The thing is that the V9 is already in the game, right? It is in the game, so... It's kind of funny because um, it's not added to any aircraft, but it is in the game. So, what is going on, right? But, yeah, it can be added to other, like, um, aircraft, like, better versions of the um, F-16 for uh, 
the Israelis, for example. Uh, but yeah, I don't think it is an Aesa, by the way. I don't think so. I'm not finding anything that it is saying that, but it has some very modernized things about the Raven. But anyway, it is a more modern version of the like Block 50s, 52s of the F-16. But it doesn't matter too much. I think at the end of the day, if they want to, they can just up the game with the block 50 and the block 40 that we have in the game, right? So it wouldn't matter that much. But anyway, um, it would be just an F-16C with those upgrades in Raiders and everything like that. HMS, you know, the whole package. And with that, they could actually use the Mon 20 And they did use, they, they do use, right? Uh, so um, that, of course, isn't the greatest, like filling up thing ever it's another air nation that will need an f-16 to have something but it's either that or like i said probably waiting a long time to the auto fighter until having something competitive when the fox trees come but then we have a second option which would be kind of crazy to have but remember how germany sold mig 29 g's or gave them mig 29 g's you know to poland so yeah, they modernized those things. They had new RWRs, new avionics, new a lot of new little things. But the thing is that it is this aircraft was given to Ukraine in a certain war that is happening right now. And there are plans to add the Mon 20 to that. So is it added? No, it's not even far from it, if I'm not mistaken. But they did integrate with other weapon systems that are a little bit more simple, like, for example, the AGM-88. Um, so, I mean, technically it could happen, right? I mean, it would be kind of a very big stretch, but technically it could happen. Like, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't feel right with this. I would still prefer the F-16. It would be too much of a... Hopeful, hopeful thinking because it, I don't think it even has a project or they're working on it. I, I don't know exactly. I mean, the, a lot of these things are classified, right? Uh, but at the end of the day, I mean, technically it would be possible, especially if they change the radar itself. Uh, it would be probably very easy to integrate the Mon 20 to the MiG 29, right? But again, I, does it make a lot of sense? Not really, right? I mean, it would be a lot better to just have the F 16 uh, there and yeah go with it until the auto fighter is added right uh so i don't know these are the two options that i think would be great for germany of course the first one is a lot better uh, but let me know in the comments what would you like to see in germany um between the auto fighter like should we wait for the auto fighter or should we just get it right now and power creep everybody else should we have the f-16 or maybe that weird mig 29 that doesn't really do that but maybe for the game's sake it could it's a very big stretch i don't know <laughs> let me know in the comments what you think about this and i see you guys on the next one bye guys 